Uh, good evening all. After all technical discussion then comes the interesting part finance and I am representing that one. So I will also like to uh, summarize uh, what I wanted to share in a quick manner. So, uh, can you just go to next slide and uh, accordingly. So uh, I will skip this part. Should be all, you all know that we are a development finance institution uh, like NABAD works for agriculture and rural development. We work for MSME sector and, and through various manner we have the mandate. So through direct mode and indirect mode also we have network of around 80 branches. There we take the real feel of MSMEs. We understand what is the need of on the ground. And accordingly, those network we also use to uh, finance the MSMEs. And our biggest chunk is indirect finance through which we refinance banks and BFCs and, and uh, ultimate beneficiaries are um, MSMEs then. Then we have several other initiatives like promotion development and all that I would like to skip here at this time. Next please. So we all know Panchamrit, so on, on the background of this Panchamrit and our country's commitment only this, this is getting a kind of moment in the country to get net neutral and all. So this also I will skip now, you all are very much known to this. Uh, on the background of Panchamrit, so today uh, even our chairman also mentioned, our GM also mentioned in earlier session that should be is aligned to government's intention, government's uh, uh, objective and we have created a separate vertical which is green climate finance vertical which I am representing here and these are our focus area right now where we, uh, we have taken several initiatives energy efficiency, renewable energy, waste management, e-mobility, green building and all. So uh, we are uh, supporting these segments through in, in mission mode through some, some, some projects some uh, products and some missions. Next please. So uh, we, uh, to have thrust on our side, we have this year uh, adopted these five mission. Uh, mission. First mission is solar for solar rooftop. Second is for EVs. Third is for energy efficiency. Energy efficiency, we are anyway working since 2004, five with several multilaterals. The fourth one, which is today's topic here is waste to environment test. So here we are supporting waste management sector. I will uh, I will have little discussion on that. And then the nurture the nature here T represents the technology, innovative technology which is which is climate positive and supporting climate. Uh, some of the technology I could find here also. Maybe we can discuss on those. Next please. And uh, uh, as I mentioned, we have our branches. Through branch network also we direct support, we support uh, directly to MSMEs through our loan products. Those are all uh, very simplified processes and we believe in digitization and through digitization in fact many many things have been, uh, the complexities have been re uh, removed and, and uh, in digital mode only we are processing loans, reducing turnaround time, reducing ha uh, like uh, harassment to MSMEs. Uh, they earlier they we used to come to branches for maybe eight to ten times it was taking around one month but i can tell you that we have products where we can in fact sanction the loan within 48 hours also on once you apply and that way we have reduced carbon footprint per loan there also like we are contributing both our side and msme side next this is one of our product where uh, very very simplified product we are supporting uh, up to 7.5 crore to msmes here uh, on the loan has to be around 5 to 7 years can be repayment period interest rate is repo rate linked starting from 7 to 8 percent in fact to support energy efficiency and the greener side even waste waste management also the the good ratings are in fact getting the rates which is even lower than our cost so this is into in energy efficiency this was supported by world bank also we have got some grant and then we have blended that grant to, to this facility and we are uh, we have done uh, means we have supported many many uh, msmes under this 4e 
uh, and and you can see there we are we are providing 100% finance which is literally exceptional in banking industry if any msme can get 100% finance uh, under any product next please this is also uh, e gps express green power for sustainability that was uh, that is what i was mentioning that under this you can uh, have a digital journey entirely and then you can get your loan sanction within 48 hours this is up to 1 crore loan and in fact we are considering this to increase also but uh, this e gps has also like since when it has come uh, many uh, good uh, feedbacks we are getting from msmes and and uh, the complexities have been removed under this so this also you can try next and this one is uh, the umbrella of our product green finance scheme so whatever is not covered under 4e or egps can be covered under green finance scheme there are some limitations there like three year balance sheet has to be there in 4e and egps but here even greenfield projects also can be uh, supported uh, for manufacturing industry it is the loan up to 20 crore and aggregators can get up to 50 crore the contribution is up to 10 percent or minimum 10 percent promoters contribution and up to 90 percent can be the loan repayment period is 10 years so uh, why i'm mentioning these schemes basically because why, when we uh, go to industry go to industries they always uh, show their issues with banks that banks are not supporting they are asking for collaterals and and th this much of promoter contribution and so many formalities under these three products basically we have tried to support the msmes in, in at the maximum way and in fact this these are very very customized product if you go into detail maybe we can discuss one to one if you have something or maybe in your network these are very very customizable product next please so uh, especially for the waste management side so we have taken a number of initiatives uh, one is direct credit we are providing and the second one i mentioned that we are supporting through banks and nbfc through refinance route this is our third approach where we are supporting banks and nbfcs and in fact msmes in little different ways in morning we discussed about resharing facilities supported by world bank the energy efficiency projects where even everything is all all good but there is no collateral security available and, and bank hesitate to provide loan there. So the, those can be covered under that PRSF, partially sharing facility that works as complement to collateral. We very recently we introduced this risk sharing facility for municipal solid waste projects. This is also under NAMA facility and supported by GIZ and Mahua. So here also, if your project is uh, otherwise um, viable, feasible, good, all good, but banks are asking for collateral security and hesitating to provide you the loan, we can give the guarantee to bank under this facility. This is uh, up to six crore rupee, and and so that the, it should be the triple A rated uh, triple A rated uh, institution and also backed by GIZ. This, this facility is already with us and we have started issuing guarantee for such projects. So if you have the project where the feed stock, the raw material is being used uh, as, as a municipal solid waste and you are looking for a loan to, with any bank and they are asking for collateral security, you can just inform them that Sidbi is offering this guarantee which complements the requirement of collateral like cgtmsc you all know this also works like that but it's uh, uh, premium is a little less and coverage is a little more and it is specially designed for municipal solid waste sector this is one and then uh, we are in discussion with world bank again for uh, resharing facility for compressed biogas so this municipal solid waste facility is where raw material is municipal solid waste the that the world, world bank facility which is about to come it is around 265 million dollar facility where the end product is compressed biogas the feedstock can be anything this is in very advanced stage of discussion and maybe probably few months we will see the light yes sir. so uh, 
uh, that obviously you will, you will get to know when that facility comes but this municipal waste sharing facility is already rolling it is working uh, so you may connect with us for that next please next next please uh, this I will skip morning also we discussed we have cluster based approach we are working in uh, adopting clusters for specific issue like Muradabad we mentioned uh, in the morning we have some um, clusters already adopted and some we are going to work on next please so that's all from myself thank you